blue inhaler is the iconic asthma inhaler and most people will be able to distinctly recognize it. This is also called the reliever inhaler and it should only be used if symptoms are present or if the person is having an asthma attack. However, like the brown preventative inhalers, these must be administered correctly and the doctor or asthma specialist will show the person how to do this once they have the prescription. Again, like with the brown inhalers, there are three main types of inhaler, MDIs, DPIs and BAIs. This may be obvious to some, but remember that the inhaler cannot be used if you don't have it on your person or nearby in a safe place. If you have been prescribed a reliever inhaler, make sure to always keep it near you, if not, preferably on your person. This makes sure that you always have it near you in the case of an emergency. The drugs inside the reliever inhaler are called bronchodilators. When they reach the lungs via inhaling, they relax the muscles surrounding the airway passageways, the bronchi and bronchioles. The two main bronchodilator drugs found within blue inhalers are called subutamol and tabutaline. In terms of both function and effectiveness, there is not much difference between the two. The only main difference being that subutamol is less expensive. With both the preventative and reliever inhalers, it's important to remember that they can come in many different variants. For example, their names and or colours may not be normal, and some may not even be shaped like normal inhalers. A common example of this is the Accuhaler, which is disc-shaped. 